This is Zayden. This is Lego Pasta. And these two are lovers. Nah, bro, I'm just playing. These are the mob gamers. Wow, what a nice intro. Anyway, I'm loading the game. I've already bought a house. Here it is. It's a pretty nice house. First thing I had to do was buy an extra bed. Lego Pasta and Zayden, they're not lovers. I bought a computer, otherwise they wouldn't be the gamers. Lego Pasta became a tech guru. Zayden became a scientist. Based off our real life professions. Here's Lego Pasta baking a cake. Not sure what exactly he's doing. These randos showed up at our house. We invited them in. Zayden sat down. This chick stood up, didn't want to be near him. Zayden decided he wanted to adopt a dog. So here's the dog. We adopted him and I named him Jake. This is Zayden trying to take a photo of the dog. He was just getting his ass. Some chick showed up. Her name's Eliza. Talking to Lego Pasta. She followed Lego Pasta into the bathroom. Kind of weird. She went home thinking about her bed. I think she was rizzed up. But at least Lego Pasta can play video games now that she's gone. Here's that photo of Zayden's ass. It's on the wall now. Zayden's at work. He's being scanned by the robot. This bloke showed up. It looks like a vampire. Lego Pasta came and greeted him. They're having a little chat. Jake's drinking from the toilet. My Sims did nothing social for 24 hours. Even though they live together. Lego Pasta came home from work. Got a promotion. Accidentally said Zayden dislikes gaming. Had to go fix it, make sure Zayden does like video gaming. Now Jake over here, this is him rolling in his own piss. Jake's hella dirty, but we don't have a bath. I had to buy one just for him. And then Lego Pasta set the house on fire. After that mishap, we went to the dog park. Lego Pasta's flirting up a storm with this old lady. Lego Pasta got hella riz. Jake got the fastest time ever in the dog course. I set the ring on fire. Jake jumped through it with no care in the world. Today is love day and Zayden and Lego Pasta started flirting. Maybe they are lovers. We went to this nice place, had a pool, we went swimming together. Here's Lego Pasta risen up a teenager. Her dad showed up. I realized that Lego Pasta had a mad beard, which gave me an idea. It's time to put my ultimate plan into action. So I started off the only way I know how, by shaving and then inviting a girl over. Step two, build a room you can trap the female in until she falls in love with you. And eventually agrees to give you her body so you can have a child. Now that the girl's here, it's time for Lego Pasta to show off his immaculate riz. And then there was this random girl in our house. I have no idea how she got there, but two birds with one stone. So I got them to the room and I locked the door for everybody that doesn't live in the house. Then I let Lego Pasta do his thing. Riz. And hey, look at that. They're getting really into it. They eventually started showering in front of each other. Pretty hot. I let them out so they could go home and sleep. And then this one came back and decided to be Lego Pasta's girlfriend. Right as Lego Pasta was about to fuck the shit out of his new girlfriend, this other chick showed up, already doing the dishes. Perfect candidate. So Zayden started rizzing her up. Anyway, they started fucking as well. In the same bed, mind you. Which is kind of weird. I bought Lego Pasta this Insta-Large, which I figured was going to give him huge muscles after he drank it. Uh, let's just switch to the live reaction. <laughs> I thought it gave him muscle. I thought it gave him muscle. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> as you can see, Lego Pasta is absolutely huge right now. He's about as pregnant as his girlfriend is. Here you can get a grasp of actually how huge he is. While Lego Pasta was gaming, we got a call that his child was born. So he headed right over and I had to instantly age up the child for my plan and apply a little bit of cheating so I could change her name to gaming and her first name because I didn't like the way Taylor was spelt. It was kind of, it was, it was really gross actually. I had to do some more cheating here. I didn't really want to, I had to give myself money. I gave myself too much just to expand the house now that we have a baby here. Here's Lego Pasta doing his parent duties. I did the same thing for Zayden's kid once it was born. It was a boy, which is actually perfect. Now we've got Dominic and Taylor. Look at him playing. Here's Lego Pasta and Zayden being great parents. That's the whole thing. Like and subscribe.